Today, I unveil another hidden facet of Muhammad Qasim's journey, a dream I've aptly named Abdurrahman. This chronicles the transformation from piety to the emergence of an antichrist. The story revolves around Abdurrahman, an inherently virtuous individual blessed with a life of comfort by Allah. In a time long ago, Allah selected two souls for an arduous trial, and the one who proved victorious would earn the title of Imam al-Mahdi. Among them, Abdurrahman stood out, his devotion resonating deeply with Allah, capturing his attention while Qasim remained in the background. Allah's master plan encompassed three trials. In the first, Qasim effortlessly emerged as the victor. The second trial saw Abdurrahman triumphant. Qasim, sincerely joyful for Abdurrahman, offered his congratulations. In contrast, Abdurrahman's response was a scornful laugh, a display of hubris that displeased Allah. This arrogance, laugh, and mockery led to Allah's decision to replace Abdurrahman, appointing Qasim as the Imam al-Mahdi in his stead. Allah, however, remains true to his promises. Despite transferring Abdurrahman's position to Qasim, Allah endowed Abdurrahman with five powers due to his victory in the second trial. These powers granted him immense capabilities, including the ability to misguide people. Unfortunately, Abdurrahman's heart underwent a transformation, giving way to bitterness, envy, and malice. Now, the tale takes a sinister turn. Abdurrahman emerges as the Antichrist, a force diametrically opposed to all that is virtuous and divine. 